Creating a curved wall. Creating a curved wall can be a little tricky and time consuming, but it's worth the effort. And um, hopefully these steps, steps will simplify it for you. First thing you need to do is measure your distance from your exterior wall to your other exterior wall. Mine is 5.98. I now need to create a wall separate from the house that is 5.98. 5.98 meters by 0 0.5 one meters so that gives me my length and my thickness use the push pull to pull it up match its height to your other existing wall we're going to uh, put a construction line in front of that wall now and the construction line will come out two meters because I want the curve to be two meters out from the wall Using this tool here, which is the arc tool, select two point arc. Click on the end point at one side of your wall. Click on the end point at the other side of your wall and then draw it out till it hits your construction line. Make sure you can see online. So now you have an arc that is the same length as the exteriors of your walls and it comes out two meters. We're going to use the offset tool. Select the outer edge of the arc and you want to offset it by 0.1, which in theory should be the thickness of your wall. You're going to use the push pull tool to pull your wall up one meter. And this gives you the base of your windows if you choose to have your windows this way. So now we need to do some uh, erasing to get rid of this wall. So select your eraser and start clicking on the sections of the wall and erase those. Now I'm going to orbit and I need to be careful when I do these other erasings because I want to make sure that I don't go too far. So I want to take this line and this line now I need to zoom in and just tidy up these little bits here and the same on the other side I'm going to orbit around again so you need to select your curved wall and to do that you need to be fairly precise so I try and get my curved wall so there's nothing else selected or nothing else is going to get in the way and with the selection tools I can select the wall. Now you note here I've picked up a little bit of this wall here. Hold the shift key in. You should notice a plus minus beside your cursor. Click on that just to check that there's nothing else that's selected apart from your wall. You can orbit to check that. And yep, yeah, I've just got the wall. So now I'm going to uh, use this corner here. So I've got the curved wall, I've got the whole curved wall selected and nothing else. Choose the move tool, click on the bottom corner, the end point of the curved wall and you can see I can move it independently. Now I need to bring it to that end point in the wall and it will say end point. Click and you've released it. Use the orbit tool to check that it's gone around to the other side. Now if you want to add um, window shapes in, I think the easiest way to do that would be to put some sections on your curved wall um, and where you're going to do those is up to you but use the pencil tool and I can scribe some little marks here so I've got those two and I'll do another one here another one here just going to orbit that back a bit and zoom out. Okay, so you can use the push pull tool to pull these little sections up to make them the same height as the rest of your wall. That will give you openings. The tricky part will be um, putting windows in there 
and perhaps that's something you can investigate yourself looking for other tutorials on YouTube.